Could turn your joy and laughter to tears and pain. It's love, it's envy of a love today. Don't delay, sin is in right away, and hate, hate, hate's going round, is breaking many hearts, yes it is, stop, Y'all know it's gone too far. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Mm. All right, I can talk now. Listen here. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, my illustrious family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house. Um, but we talk mentals. Okay, so mental talk. We here, we here. You know, I just want to make sure that we're cognitive of what our responsibility is, in my opinion, as light beings on the planet. Some of us are very dark right now. Some of us and are filled with hatred, and you know it's understandable. Uh, but how we act out on that hatred is where the problem becomes either yay or nay. And what I wanted to just talk about briefly, y'all, uh, is it's like it's like that, that that show, bad boys, bad boys, what they gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do, y'all? I want you to understand, look at the script. Look at the script. And as you always see that older people say, you can open up your hand and see five separate fists, fingers, or you can ball them together and, and see a fist to strike a mighty blow. And what has happened, in my opinion, my humble opinion, is they've got us hating on each other so much that now we good and right now. We can dance we can stick a fork in the in, in in the um in the meat because we're done. Um the Democrats Republican everything fat skinny rich poor everything this monster a, a diabolical spirit would use to turn humanity against each other and rule it with fear, um, it has done to us. And so after century after century, um, having to experience this type of trauma and abuse is very difficult to come back from. So this world is either going to end, and it's not going to end nicely, okay? You all of a sudden see, um, you know, just it just seems like it's just totally out of control. And I know each generation says that. But I, I can't remember a time in my life where uh, a bunch of white men rushed the Capitol. 
uh, talking about somebody did them, them wrong when they've been an oppressor of everybody non-white in America. It's just the mind is um, just boggled by that. So that, that goes to show me that the gaslighting, that the projection that is going is working. And I mean, it's worked. Because these people actually think somebody is trying to replace them when in essence, it is them trying to replace everybody else being afraid that the browning of America is what they can't take. Who in their right mind, what sane and rational society would say if a woman is raped by her father or her brother, then she has to keep the baby? I mean, just listen to how mind-boggling that is. And think about what the mind of the people that must be that's okay with that. Right? So what has to happen, y'all, is what you gonna do when they come for you? Because if you hate LGBTQ, <coughs> um, if you hate Democrats and you're a Republican, if you hate and hate and hate and hate, and you hate um um, you know, Christians and you're a Muslim or you're a Muslim and you hate Christians, what's going to happen, you guys, is there's not going to be nobody left when they come for us. And when I say come for us, is if you're, if they separate you from whoever, you're going to be left alone. If you're a hillbilly and you think that 45 was your best hope and he's going to or put an end to all of this. What you think is going to happen when he has a mean to his end? He's not going to have nothing to do with you. So you're going to be standing out there alone. If you are a black person and you hate, 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 oh, she gay, oh, he a fag, oh, he this, that, yeah, this. As, as much as we've been hated upon, as much as we've been hated upon, nobody can present and put an agenda on your family if you tight in your family. If you run your family, your, your mindset is going to overpower your whatever enemy try to come up against it. And you have to believe that and you have to trust God. If you lead your offspring in the right way, it might be a boomerang. They might go out a little bit, but they won't stray. They'll come back. And if we don't realize that the time now um, is, is very crucial, we have, um, again, like I said, these evangelical racists, uh, they're a certain type of Christian. they like Christian uh, uh, fascists. They want a piece of the pie, too. They want all y'all gay, transgender, and lesbian. and all. They want y'all gone. And so for those of us that don't want to speak up for nobody's rights, all I'm saying is don't feel bad when they come for you. Because historically, if you're not a white male and you don't fit that description, and an insane one at that. One that'll follow another man as opposed to uh, a party or a constitution or whatever. Then you know you're dealing with a cult member. And you rather follow that than to make peace with humanity. It's pretty sad, family. But I'm going to see you in the next video. And I want to know what you think about it. Do you think it's too late? Two pace been swole too far out the two. Let me know. Leave your comments below. Alright, I'll see you in the next one.